I'm really looking to keep expressing my ideas of how nature, humanity and technological approaches can intersect. How these three can really come to equilibrium. I have been passionate about the arts in general. When I was in middle school, I gradually sort of realised, OK, there is a profession called design. I see it as in it sits between extreme imagination and real world problem solving. When I was studying fashion design, you know, there's just the reality, the painful reality, how the way the industry works is extremely wasteful. And that is the reason that I really want to dive deep into, you know, finding an alternative solution to really change that. Seaweed and algae application in textile products. It is very early stage, which is hugely exciting. I find it beautiful to go to the seaside to be able to observe and research and collect these drifted seaweed to see visually how they're moving in the water, how they're growing. Things are transient and constantly on move, like fluid. I'm really looking into finding design solutions to look at technology and science from a humane angle, integrating it into the structure to make it flexible and durable as part of my textile piece. To use this like really ambitious techniques of digital fabrication it really gives like, you know, almost like unlimited potential to what you can do with these nature-based materials. So I'm hoping that I'll be able to create something that is hybrid, physical and digital. This idea of humanity within technology. I'm very intrigued about how the heritage and the craftsmanship of Rolls Royce and all these hands-on techniques really respecting the natural material itself. You know, really to work around it. People are starting to understand more and more, okay, there is a life cycle. As designers, how do we think deeper into, you know, designing its life cycle? I think that's something that I'm trying to focus on, which I believe a lot of people are looking into for a solution as well.